American actor and writer Joe Flaherty is best known for his work on the Canadian sketch comedy, SCTV shows and movies such as Freaks and Geeks and Happy Gilmore. His television career spanned nearly five decades with credits on comedy shows like Frasier and Family Guy. If we talk about Flaherty's love life, he was married to Judith Dagley for 22 years until their divorce in 1996. Flaherty died on the 1st of April 2024. He died after a short illness at the age of 84. Former World Series winner, American attorney, and baseball executive Larry Lachino whose Boston Red Sox team won three World Series while he was president and CEO. Lucino helped build championship teams, including the first World Series title for the organization in 86 years in 2004. The team also won in 2007 and 2013. Lucino, who was a three-time cancer survivor, died on the 2nd of April 2024, he died of natural causes at the age of 78. Tony winner, American playwright Christopher Durang is best known for his work on popular plays such as Sister Mary Ignatius Explains It All For You, Vanya and Sonia, and Masha and Spike. His play, Vanya and Sonia and Masha and Spike, won the Tony Award for the Best Play in 2013. Durang died on the 2nd of April, 2024. He died of complications from aphasia, which is thought to be caused by Alzheimer's disease. He was 75 years old. American actor M. Emmett Walsh, who's being remembered for his work on popular movies such as Blade Runner, Blood Simple, and Fletch. He appeared in more than 200 films and television shows and graced screens for over five decades. He also had recurring appearances on various television shows, including Picket Fences and Home Improvement. Walsh died of cardiac arrest on March 19, 2024, three days before his 89th birthday. American casting director Diane Crittenden who worked as head of casting at Warner Brothers. She helped cast actors for popular movies such as Star Wars, Witness, Pretty Woman, and Days of Heaven. Diane passed away on the 20th of March, 2024. She died of cancer at the age of 82. American astronaut Thomas P. Stafford flew on two Gemini missions and one Apollo mission. In 1965, he piloted Gemini 6A. Stafford was one of 24 NASA astronauts who flew to the moon but didn't land there. There are only seven left alive today. Among other leadership roles, he served as director of the NASA Johnson Space Center after retiring from NASA and the Air Force. Stafford passed away on the 18th of March, 2024, he died of liver cancer at the age of 93. Belarusian ice hockey player Konstantin Koltsov was popular for playing alongside teams like the Pittsburgh Penguins, Salavat Yuliv Yufa, and the national team. During his career, Koltsov represented Belarus at nine world championships, including the Winter Olympics in 2002 and 2010. After retiring from hockey, he became an assistant for the Belarusian men's hockey team. If we talk about Koltsov's love life, he began publicly dating Belarusian tennis player Arena Sabalenka since 2021. Koltsov took his own life on the 18th of March, 2024. He jumped from a balcony. Koltsov was 42 at the time of his death. Oscar winner, British-American screenwriter David Seidler, who's being remembered for his work on popular movies such as The King's Speech, Quest for Camelot, Tucker, The Man and His Dream. He gained widespread recognition for his work on The King's Speech, which became his most celebrated and acclaimed project. David's early career started writing translation dubs for Japanese monster movies. 
He won the Academy Award for Best Original Screenplay for The King's Speech at the 83rd Academy Awards in 2011. David passed away on the 16th of March 2024. He died of natural causes at the age of 86. Canadian actress Jennifer Leake, who was popular for her work in movies such as Yours, Mine and Ours, Eye of the Cat and Another World. She also played guest spots on various television shows, including Macmillan and Wife, Hawaii Five O, and The Mary Tyler Moore Show. Jennifer passed away on the 18th of March 2024 at the age of 76. She died of progressive supranuclear palsy after suffering from the disease for more than seven years. Russian actress Tatyana Konyakova, who's best known for her work on popular movies such as Over Tissa, Balzaminov's Marriage, and Moscow Doesn't Believe in Tears. Tatyana passed away on the 2nd of April 2024. She died of natural causes at the age of 92.